Welcome back to Good Day, everyone. This morning, we are live here at Home Depot, getting your house all decorated mm -hmm. for the holidays. Now, of yeah. course, you can come here. You've got the wonderful Flo Renault here hanging out with us this morning. But, Flo, you guys have lights and decorations yep. and trees. Yep. But we're getting a bit more hands-on this morning. Yeah, well, I made sure that every every time I see you, we usually do a nice segment at the studio, but I made sure that you're going to get good and dirty this morning. It, I shouldn't be the Can't only one wait. that's a mess. <laughs> I shouldn't be the only one's a mess. You brought up the decorations, so we do have our live trees mm -hmm. in. We do have the lights. We do have all kinds of stuff still here for the holiday season. Wonderful. I can't believe, what's today, the 10th? It's Boy, that went fast. Two weeks. Two weeks. Thanks. Crazy. Thanks. Crazy. Thanks. All right. So the Kendall family tradition is to come on Black Friday and get our Christmas tree mm -hmm. from Home Depot. We do get our Christmas tree. But we're uh, hanging out here in the yeah. saw department. Yeah. This couple, is, a couple drills here. Yeah. How are we doing this for Christmas? This, this is actually our demo area. We've got some really cool products here. You know, we carry all the name brands. We carry Makita. We carry DeWalt. We carry okay. Ryobi. Uh, we carry all the top names, but we're going to, a couple little things here. We have this demo area. We can come in, you can come in, you can play with, with the, uh, with the Makita, nice. the brushless combo kit that has the drill. You do can come in and do drive. that. Yeah, do a little Love run. That. Run it before you buy it. We've got a bunch of drills, but today you're going to be making reindeer. You know those reindeer that sit on people's lawns? We are. You're going to be working with a scroll saw today. All right. So this is the scroll saw. This is a scroll saw. This is a Ryobi variable speed. Now, the, the easiest thing to know about that is it's got a speed control on it. So okay. if you're real acclimated to it and you're real comfortable with it, you can run it real fast. Or if you're doing straight lines, mm -hmm. if you're doing curves and stuff, which you're going to be doing today, we'll you'll be going slow. slow. <laughs> yeah, you can slow it down just a little bit. So okay. it's real easy to use. We put a fresh blade in it last night. We're going to be doing it with, uh, this is quarter-inch luon. Okay. Now, if you're going to be making something, if you were really going to put this on your front lawn, you'd use a heavier piece of wood. You would thicker. use use something thicker, and you would also use something for outdoor. Okay. Now, you can use regular plywood, but you're, you're going to have to either paint it or seal it or do mm -hmm. it something so it can stay outside in the weather. Okay. But for uh, demonstration purposes, we're going to be using this little quarter-inch oak Luan, Sounds so like it'll be, be easier for you. A little easier to cut. It's going to be Love easier that. on you now to cut. Now, we've got some friends here, the yeah. Peanuts Gang. I mean, just showing off the, the detail that yeah. you can do with mm -hmm. this saw. It's amazing what you can do with it. I've seen people do work. Uh, we had a, as a matter of fact, he was a master electrician at my mm -hmm. other store in Cordial, that he did some of the most amazing scroll saw work that I have ever, ever seen. Mm -hmm. It looked like he carved it out w with a knife. It was just absolutely amazing. Goodness. But he all did it on the scroll, scroll saw because you're going to see, you're going to be able to go around corners and stuff. Somebody cut out and drew the little Peanuts characters. I love it. I'm not sure who, who drew them. And I don't want to do a copyright infringement. So <laughs> I hear you. I hear they're you. getting in trouble. I don't think Charles Schultz is around anymore. But that's the kind of detail you can get into. You can get the uh, different uh, teeth on the blade so you can get into a finer cut or stuff like that. You can do this. Then you uh, sand it, usually with a belt mm -hmm. sander. Or you can sand it with just with a little with hand sander. Hand. Well, we won't pay them. We won't be getting quite into this much detail, but we are going to be testing our hand at it. And, guys, if I can do it, you can. So come on down. Come to Home Depot and get all your decorating needs. It's coming up live here on Good Day in just a few minutes. First, Chris, back on over to you. Welcome back to Good Day, everyone. We're live here at Home Depot mm -hmm. making some reindeer. We got our reindeer legs here. <laughs> but, Flo, you just went online and yeah. found this pattern. Mm -hmm. Who knew she was such an artist because she uh, enlarged it a bit and drew this uh, this freehand. But you can just yeah. go online and uh, find patterns. Yeah, this is a pretty basic pattern. This is the uh, classic reindeer. You can see the body. You'll see mm -hmm. the antlers and the legs. And they all just fit into one another. But you can go online. You know, you can find anything on the Internet and just type in scroll saw patterns. Now, this happens to be a little bit bigger scroll saw, as okay. I was just telling you. This is a 16-inch, so it's got a little bit wider gap here. So, so you, you can fit those big bigger pieces, pieces and there. rotate them around and that sort of thing. But like I said, you can just go online and print it out to whatever size. Mm -hmm. You can take them to... Um, you know, to one of the office stores and sure. either enlarge it or just do what I do. Just freehand it. That's the cool thing about it is Being anything goes. I love it. I love it. All right. Now, I You're did see, get some practice. We got to <laughs> safety first, put yep. on our safety goggles. And uh, for everybody at home, again, I've gotten my little lesson, but go ahead and describe mm -hmm. what I'm going to be doing. Okay. What you're going to be doing is, is, again, this is a variable speed scroll saw. So we've got the speed mm -hmm. on it. Now, when you first started, remember, you said to me, put it on do real it slow. slow. But you just realize that it actually makes it harder if you go slow because it's got to take more time to go through the woods. So faster, mm -hmm. you don't want to lose control of it, obviously, sure. because you want to go home with all ten. <laughs> don't want to lose a finger. With. 
but it actually it goes through the wood a little bit quicker. Now this is a one-sided blade. Okay. We've got the adjustment on it where depending on the thickness of your wood, you can, move you it can raise down. it. So bring okay. that in there just a little bit before we start it. And we're going to set the guide just on top of it. Again, this is quarter inch oak glue on. Okay, we're going to tighten that down. Okay. Does that feel like it's moving okay for you? I think you? it looks pretty good. Okay. So right, shoot, we're you've flip got this your little on. lesson. Yep. Don't forget to adjust your speed. All right. So it's on. Yep. Make it a little faster. Go for it. And here we go. Ah, oh, such a pro. <laughs> or not. <laughs> oh. That's okay. I'm going a little off the line. Now, how do I get this out? Turn it off. Okay. Now, turn it off. And all you're going to do is you're just going to back it oh. right up. There's a wiggle a little, little bit. <laughs> that was the problem. Okay, yeah. I've never seen anybody catch the blade. <laughs> Good work. We're going to keep you. How did oh, you careful. do that? Well, you know... It's a Monday. Yeah, it's a Monday night. <laughs> Wait, there we go. There you go. All right, back on. All right, round two. We're going to get this thing set up. we got other parts of our reindeer to cut out. We're making it all live here at Home Depot. Hopefully they don't touch the wood on this one. But Kelly, back on over here. Hey, right, guys, we are live here at Home Depot. We've got all the pieces of our reindeer. Saw them out. Kind of resembles a Dr. Seuss character reindeer. <laughs> He's uh, got all of his antlers, but they're not quite symmetrical. But that's all right, because right. nobody's perfect. Reindeers aren't perfect. When we come back, we're going to be putting them all together and assembling them and learning about all the wonderful things that they've got here at Home Depot to get you ready for the holidays. It's all coming right after this. A little bit more of a curve on them. Sounds good. There that backside. Go. Put that on there. We might and just slide them right yes. in? Just slide oh, them oh. right into that slot. Okay. We might put that slot a little bit big. Now put your front feet under there. Same way. Okay. Okay. Look and at you that. Angle, you angle him a little bit. Put his tail on. Oh. And now he's a. Oh, doesn't have a red nose or anything. Oh, oh, oh. That didn't happen. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Okay, I'll hold his legs. You put his tail on. <laughs> Press his tail on. The tail's wedged a little tight. That's okay. You don't want to lose your tail. I think the tail's a little small. The tail's, the tail's okay. good. Now, I do have to say that. That your viewers don't know, she cut this out completely by herself. I was going to help well, her. I said, "I'm going to do, I'm going to do the hard kind. parts." She would not let this thing go. You cut that out all by yourself. She's being too kind. I think you need okay. to put the antlers on your on your roof. Well, let's hope I don't collapse. Yeah, them. I'm going to hold this. Leg. Okay, so right up here. Somewhere up there, yeah. Do they go in front or behind the ears? I don't know. Oh, okay. Well, well here comes the text messages again. Uh oh. What do you well, mean you don't know? I. Well, that's kind of a. They tell, they're they're telling me and my, they're telling my, me and my ear behind the ears. Behind, they're not behind the ears. Well, okay. There you cool. go. Behind the ears. Ta-da. Ta-da. Now all you need is a little red paint, put red on Okay. Side, and you're good to go. Now, aren't you proud of that? You're going to take that back to Look the station. Look at that, guys. Now, this is my reindeer. <laughs> I did not get a lot of sleep last night, guys, from traveling, yeah. and, uh, I just made this reindeer, He's and he incredible. looks pretty good standing awesome. up, so I'd say that's a success. <laughs> now, folks can come on down, of course, buy the saw, yeah. test it out here. Yeah, maybe not out, make, try it out. Maybe not make an entire reindeer. Uh, Why not? <laughs> Why not? You also have, um, just here in front of us, I know it's off camera right now, but an entire demo station of different drills. We have drills. We have the Dremel Max. We have, like I said, all the top tools. We have Makita. We have Black & Decker. We have Rigid. Okay. We've got all the cool things. Come on out. Try them before you buy them. And Perfect. then there's there's the never-ending favorite. A Home Depot gift card never expires. Love that. For Christmas. Size, stocking for stuffers. You. All right. Now, I know Santa's going to be uh, a little disappointed if we don't start heading over to the paint department and get some paint on this guy. Okay. Because he needs some red nose. Yes. But it's all happening live here on Good Day. <laughs> I'm pretty proud of myself. I've got to bring this Very home. Very proud of you. My uh, first homemade Christmas decoration. Yeah. All right. Chris, on over to you.